Maxwell or Maxwell Blackwood. Uh, I'm always uh, an entrepreneurial person since <laughs> since I know myself in Jamaica. Migrate to Canada here. I'm pursuing the same thing of networking and getting people to do business together. Well, what we do here is several services. Yeah, so the Black Diamond um, Center, we're into collecting and painting and sculpturing different type of art. More, or I should say specialized, are dominantly uh, Afrocentric art, Afrocentric art. So we, we, we sell the arts itself. We also do other service like custom de design framing. We do some of the best type of uh, framing around. Uh, we also have an arm of the business that sells uh, jewelry, because we're jewelers also by vocations. Uh, watch, we do watchmaking also, and we also sell watches. So the watch repair sales, etc. we are developing that. All of these dynamics are in the developing stage. Well, uh, I, this store is here, the Black Diamond has been here uh, for the past three years, but being, being an Eglinton, personally, I've been an Eglinton for the last uh, 20, 20, 28 years because I, I did have a, a jewelry business on Eglinton before, Eglinton Oakwood. Now we are Dufferin, and Dufferin on Eglinton across on the North Hill, the Black Diamond is right now. But I used to have a jewelry store called MB Exclusive Custom Design Jewelry. So I am the one that designed Ben Johnson bracelets, Leroy Sibyl as an artist, because we we're into custom design. So in, in, anybody that needs something exclusive, <laughs> we're the one to, to design that better than anybody else. We actually do that. Yes, yeah, so we've been on Eglinton for a while, but this location about the last three years. Well, I have to stay on Eglinton because as challenging as it is, and I would say sometimes because of the Metrolink work here, the, the business community has been in a very challenging mode because of the this construction and the less traffic. But still, you want to stay in the area and develop it. If, if you run away, then nothing's going to happen. So I believe we should stay here and develop it, notwithstanding the challenge. The challenges. Yes. So, yes, I want to stay in the community and help to develop. If the community succeed, and the community will succeed, all of us will succeed. A little Jamaica, you always, like every, every other community, Little Italy, Chinatown, uh, you know, all other community, uh, you always have certain indigenous uh, things that you like to, to be a part of from back home, being a part of the culture. From Jamaica, you always like to sense 
that you can go in certain area and get some of those um, things that you're used to, that you're familiar with. Whether it's food, at wraps or the entertainment uh, center, or any other business in the community, yes, we, we definitely want to be a part of the rejuvenation of the community. Um, changing, it's changing. I mean, the construction, as I'm told, will be ending soon. But I, I, when you see what happened with, nobody did anticipate the COVID-19 here. So that's why people can't just say this is gonna happen this time or that time. Uh, it's, 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 it has been a challenge as I'm saying, but again, I always say when people ask me how is business, I said it's what you make of it. Well, here in Eglinton, we like like what you're doing now. Your your company is trying to promote the area, so we'd like more people to know that we're still in Eglinton, and they should come and visit our 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 community, especially persons of African origin. Uh, we always, not complained, but we always say uh, we're not supporting each other that we should. Well, we should change that. We should be what we want. So we can't say we don't support. We have to come and prove to each other that we, we can support each other and change the whole trajectory. Yeah. The art is culture. We have a great interest in culture, as Bob Marley said, children. <laughs> Forget not your culture. Uh, so I'm, uh, and culture to me is not just your food and music. Culture is is innate in, in one thinking. So uh, I think the, 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 the art and artifacts that we carry is very important to, to educate or inform, especially the younger one, about the culture. And so it's not just selling something or monetizing things and you sell something and you're gone. We're into having people to be informed about the, the, the arts and the culture so they can pass it on and also bring the children. It's like a museum, you bring the children to inform them about uh, what, what you're doing and what these things represent, these artifacts. Just like when you have a bank or a supermarket, you need a gallery or an art in the community, just as important.